It's game day here in New Orleans, Bougiana, and the Zombies fans are really fired up, mostly due to the flamethrowers the SWAT team has used against them in the parking lot. Nothing like the smell of smoking ribs at the tailgate party. Hey, Grim, I stopped by this voodoo hex for some shrunken head guy had set up out there. Two hexes for ten bucks. Put one on my wife's divorce attorney and the other on the kid at the coffee shop for not leaving enough room for my cream. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Atlanta Vultures take on the New Gorland Zombies. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. And then these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. Hot one, hot two, hot three. The Mel Cats will give them a first down. Now, I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot A great throw and a great catch, but sadly to the wrong team. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And with another pick, the QB says, I, Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a licking and keeps on ticking. Second down and more than the QB would like. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Caught for the first down. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Hot one, hot two, hot. Another interception. Geez, you give this guy. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time.
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Is there any function? And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo. Bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. He's hit the... They're gaining on him. Hey, come on. Move your ass. I got a sub up right on this asshole. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Roid Rage, how do you like your brains? Scrambled or fried? And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Third down and three. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Another turnover for the D. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Does the Oh, what the brutal hit! <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. I don't know who's. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Hey man, nobody can touch me with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Pop? And it's first and ten. I'm pretty sure my baby sister can throw further than that. But she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hard. 
First down. And it's first and ten. We've got a nail biter at the end of one. Second down in a very lot. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And that'll bring him third down and seven. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Second down and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? The coach isn't liking that call. Boom, boom. His head just exploded. Second down and a lot. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Second down in a mile. <laughs> At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just... Oh! Vicious hit. There might not be an eye in team, but this guy's eyeballs are all over the other team's helmets right now. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. It's cold. Ouch, that's got to hurt. Man, those mutant traps will kill you faster than one of Brick's farts. And he bursts into the end zone for the score! What a run! Like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's first and ten. The defense calls us, and they just popped his eyes into the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting, or dead, or worse. Second down and long. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more respect. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Running for a couple of yards. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. <laughs> Third down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. And this guy has quite the female following. Listen to them. Yeah, they all want to jump his bones. I wish the middle linebacker would have jumped his bones. I just lost a saw buck on that play. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. All oh, week the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Kapow! Second down and ten. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. Oh, with the brain scrambler. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And that's some good old fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Now the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. 
And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. They pick up three on a short pass. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And that'll bring up third down and seven. You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, sure, now he catches him. I had this guy on my fantasy team. I know other said never hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. Scrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a conference home. The quarterback goes into a hurry up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? That, my friends, was an all pro. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. Two-point plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. <laughs> When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make a pay. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. The defense called a sticky ball dirty trick, and the quarterback is in a shitload of trouble. <laughs> He's trying to throw the ball. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, 
boy, where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? I'm gonna go to a strip tea show. Where we going? Hey, why don't you sell down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. First and four. He's aged better than Keith Richards. I like this. They're going for two. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Yeah, it got blown to shit. crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, man, he really wants it. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See, is that right, Grim? That penalty makes no sense. And it's something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know almost throw interceptions, but when I do, it's when the game is on the broke free and has open field in front of him. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. And he reels that one in for a first down. Oh! You knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. It's 
two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the defense gets another pick. Bam, rough day. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. And another one time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. A nice run for five yards. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. He is fighting for every, and that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. That was a nice piece of running, Vim. That's a first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth. Father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Does the QB know which team he's on? And he just slipped away like a greased pig. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. And the MFL winning is real. I know I said never hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. And the ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. Second down and two. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to what oh man he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy gotta love it he should bite his head off for an encore grim and it's first and ten oh and he might have just saved a touchdown 
down on that deflection. Second down and ten. And the quarterback throws... Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. First and ten. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Second down and a very lot. the third quarter this game is going to come down to the wire and that'll bring up third down and in inches hot one hot two hot three. now here comes the punting unit you know punters really do know how to party bricks yeah Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? And it's first and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and ten. Oh, no, it's a sticky ball, dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, friend? A yo-yo of doom? No, my friend. I didn't. I love this job. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Apparently the punter for the day is being played by my kids. The return man, what a hit that was. Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. <laughs>
First down in a mile. Not, not one. Defense is on its heels. Great run on that play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Welcome Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Quinn. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Oh, did we get out of Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns. This guy's a damn. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten it. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. The offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go, Don't You Eat That Yellow Snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. First down and less than a yard. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. Defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what a interception. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. I guess when the coach said the offense was going to be explosive this week, he meant it literally. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Third down and ten. Hot. Eight. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really... Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL.
First down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make a pay. First and ten. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The 30. The oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. First and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else come by. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Here comes the defense. The 10. First down. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. First down and three. And this kid like a monkey, and he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. He intercepted the QB's pass and returns it for a touchdown. That's not just salt in the moon. That's peeing in the answers and the smoldering remains. Ah, you are truly a man. Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this cue. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 76. Unfortunately for this home crowd, these weren't the fast, scary zombies of the modern era we're used to. Nah, they were more like those ones from the 60s or people on Insta Slam. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Well, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotrumpism. Grim 
Ultra with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not.